Good morning, children. Today, fourth class mathematics, we have to discuss about the normal divisions. That is, two-digit divisor and uh, so many digits are uh, dividend. That one we have to done as the normal division and we check the answer also using the checking formula. What is the checking formula? Dividend is equal to quotient into divisor plus remainder. Using that formula, we are verified our answer is correct or wrong. So, today we will discuss division by 100,000. Okay, what we will get the answers. First of all, in this first point, first bit division by 10. Okay, division by 10. In this, First, I am taking the first example. Okay. Examples. First, I am taking the first example that is 147 divided by 10. Okay. Here, we have to do the normal division first and what we have to check. Before going to do the problem, what we will do? We have to arrange the given number. 10. 147. Now, everyone knows the 10 table. So, no need to write the 10 table directly we can do. 10 ones, 10 minus. 4 minus 0, 4. 1 minus 1, 0. 7, 47. 10 fours, 40. Minus 7. 4 minus 4, 0. Here, what is the quotient, children? Quotient is 1440 and the remainder is 7. This one. See the one more example. Second question that is 6565 divided by 10. Okay. Here we are taking only 10 as a two digit divisor and we are taking four digit dividend here. Now check what answer you are getting. 10, 6, 5, 6, 5. 10, 6 is 60 minus 5 minus 0, 5. 6 minus 6, 0. 6, 56. 10, 5, 50 minus 6 minus 0, 0, 5 minus 5. Next, 5. 10, 6, 60. 5. If you multiply these two numbers means we will get this. You will know already. Here what is the quotient children? 6, 56 and the remainder is 5. Here observe one thing. What you have to observe means in the given question only we have one number as a 0 in the divisor. Okay. See and in the given question last one's place is Rewinding like a reminder. See here also. 0 means 5 is like a reminder. Remaining same number 656. 656 as a quotient. Here not changing the dividend numbers. We are getting the same numbers. Observe here. We have 1 0 in the 1's place means in the given dividend. Only the 1's place digit is becoming as reminder. Next to two numbers are becoming as quotient. It is the division by 10 property. Next to here, division by 100. Division by 100. Here also I will explain one example. See here. Here, first one I am taking as a 247 divided by 10. Observe here, we are getting two zeros in the given divisor. And uh, here are two places, 1's place and 10's place. These two becoming as remainder. These two becoming as quotient. If you want to means check this answer. 100, 247. 100, 2's uh, 200 minus 7 minus 0, 7, 4 minus 0, 4, 2 minus 2. Here in the 100 table 47 we don't get. So 
what is the quotient here? 2. And uh, what is the remainder? 47. Already said now. In the given divisor, 2 zeros is there means in the given quotient, 2 places that is last to first means 1's place and 10's place becoming as remainder and this 2 becoming as quotient. If you want to means share one more example also. Second example. 3523 divided by 100. Guess here which numbers are becoming as remainder and which numbers becoming as quotient. Observe the given divisor number. Here we are having two zeros. Means in the given dividend question. Ones place and tens place becoming as reminders. Next number says becoming as quotient. Check the answer if you want to means. 100, 3523. 100 is a 300. Minus 0 minus 2. 2 minus 0, 2. 5 minus 0, 5. 3 minus 3, 0. 3. 105 is a big number. So, 105 is a 500. Minus 3 minus 0, 3. 2 minus 0, 2. 5 minus 5, 0. Here, what is the quotient here? This number. 35. And what is the remainder? 23. Already said now. Same like this. One more property. That is. Division by thousand. Here also observe the examples. If you are observing the example means you will get one idea. That is 6472 divided by thousand. Guess here what is the Remainder number and what is the quotient number? Observe the given divisor. How many zeros are there? 1, 2, 3. So, in the given dividend also, right to left, you have to take 3 numbers. That is 1s, 10s, 100s. So, 6 is becoming as quotient. 472 is becoming as remainder. If you want to check the answer. 1,000, 6472, 1,000, 6 are 6,000, minus 2 minus 0, 2, 7 minus 0, 7, 4 minus 0, 4, 6 minus 6. In the 1,000 table, we want to get 472, so we have to live like this. What is the quotient here? 6, and the remainder? 472, already said 472 is the Reminder. Next, observe the second example. 35,487 divided by 1000. Here, guess which number becoming as quotient and which number is becoming as reminder. In the given divisor, how many zeros are there? 1, 2, 3. 3 zeros are there. 1, 2, 3. 3 numbers. Underline. Means, not underlining number is becoming as quotient. Underlining numbers are becoming as remainder. Check here. 1000, 35,487. 1000, 3 is 3000. Minus. Okay, 8 minus 0, 8. 4 minus 0, 4. 5 minus 0, 5. 3 minus 3. This 7. 1000 is 5000. Minus 7 minus 0, 7. 8 minus 0, 8. 4 minus 0, 4. 5 minus 5, 0. What is the quotient children here? 35. And the remainder? 487. Already I said. Like this. So many 10,000 like that. Any numbers they have to give. Just observe the zeros. Okay. How many zeros are there in the divisor number? 
and in the dividend number also underline that many numbers without underlining numbers becoming as quotient underlining numbers becoming as remainder only when they have zeros in the divisor then only it is possible okay once everyone open your textbook page number 104 here they given with tips and examples you have to copy this one in your math notebook learn and write this one what i said that only they given see here quick tip when a number is divided by 10 the digit in the ones place makes up the remainder and the rest of the digits make up the quotient you must keep the heading divide division by 10 first of all open your math notebook write down date and day and keep this heading division by 10 100 and 1000 and keep this heading division by 10 write down this formula write down this one after that write down two examples i explain here na you have to copy this one or copy this one over after again keep heading dividing division by 100 write down this formula next to two examples over after division by 1000 this formula two examples like this you have to write down in your notebook so today today your homework is what is your homework today children learn and write text to book page number 104 in mass notes that is division by 10 100 and 1000 this one so you have to write down this topic in your mass notebook read and write this is your homework today Thank you.